Now, we are going to solve one numerical example in order to fit a piecewise linear interpolating polynomial for a given set of a data. So, in order to save the time, already we write the problem. What is the problem? Problem is a obtain the piecewise linear interpolating polynomial for the function f x defined by the following data. x is a given, the values of x is a what? The values of x is a 1, 2, 4, 8, f x is a 3, 7, 21, 73, 73. Hence, estimate the value of f 3 and f of 7. So, how we find the solution? How we find the solution? If we closely observe the data, this data is a given for unequal class interval. So, here we are going to use going to use the interpolating formula for the unequal class interval. So, we cannot use here forward interpolation, backward interpolation formula or central interpolation formula for the equal class interval. So, here we are going to use the Lagrange interpolation formula to fit a polynomial between 1 to 2, 2 to 4, 4 to 8. So, here let let p 1 x equal p 1 x equal p 1 1 x x lie between x lie between 1 to 2 x lie between 1 to 2. For sake of a simplicity in order to apply the Lagrange interpolation formula here we denote this data means uh, here this one is a x 0, this one is a f 0, x 1, f 1, x 2, f 2, x 3, f 3, f 3. So, p 1 1 x is a polynomial of a degree 1 between 1 to 2 satisfying this function and p 1 2 x is a polynomial of a degree 1 between 2 to 4 and third polynomial of a degree 1 degree 1 p 1 3 x if x lie between 4 to 8 4 to 8. Now, we find p 1 1 x with the help of a Lagrange interpolating formula. So, now now, p 1 1 x by Lagrange, Lagrange's, Lagrange's interpolation, interpolation, Lagrange's interpolation formula. So, what is the Lagrange interpolation formula for the two values? So, we know that by the Lagrange interpolation formula p 1 1 x equal x minus x 1 upon x 0 minus x 1 f of 0 plus x minus x 0 divided by x 1 minus x 0 f of 1. If x lie between what? x lie between x 0 to x 1. So, as what is the values of x 0 and x 1? Here it be write x 0 equal 1 and x 1 equal to 2. So, here we put the values of a 1, 2 and 3 and 7, 3 be the value of f 0 and f 1 the value of a f 1 is a 7. So, here 1, 2. So, put the values of a x 1 and x 0. So, x minus 2 upon x 0 be the 1 minus 2. What is the value of f 0? f 0 is a 3, f 0 is a 3. So, into 3 plus x minus x 0 be the 1, x 1 be the 2, 2 minus 1, f 1 is a, what is the value of f 1? f 1 is a 7 here. So, we put the value of a 7. Now, we simplify this one. So, we simplify this one. 
then the result is a what? Result is a x minus 2 in a denominator, this become minus 1, this become 3 plus x minus 1 upon 1 into 7. So, if we simplify this result, uh, this expression minus 3 x minus 3 x plus 6 plus 7 x minus 7. So, this give the 7 x minus 3 x, 4 x and 6 minus 7, 4 x minus 1, 4 x minus 1. So, we verify the result, this one is a 4 x minus 1, this one is a p 1 1 x. Similarly, by the Lagrange interpolation formula between x 1 to x 2, what is the p 2 x? So, if we write what? Here, if we write uh, if we write a what? If we write a x 2 here p 2 x. So, p 1 2 x equal x minus x 2 upon x 1 minus x 2 f of f 1 plus x minus x 1 upon x 2 minus x 1 f 2. If x lie between x 1 to x 2. Now, again we put the values of uh, x 1 and x 2 f 1 and f 2. So, once we denote the values of uh, what is the values of uh, f 1, f 1 is a 7 2 4 7 21, 2 4 7 21. So, here we write it x minus 4, 2 minus 4 into 7 plus x minus 2 upon 4 minus 2 into 21, into 21. So, if we simplify this this become x minus 4 upon 2 minus 4 become minus 2 into 7 plus x minus 2 upon 2 into 21, 21. So, if we simplify this become 7 x, 7 x minus 7 x plus 28 divided by 2 plus 21 x minus 42 divided by 2. So, if we simplify this 21 x minus 7 x become 21, this become 14 divided by 2. So, this become 7 x and 28 minus 42, 28 minus 42 minus 28, this become what? This become minus 4 and 3 to 1 divided by 2. So, this become what? What is the result? 7 x minus 7, 7 x minus 7. Similarly, we put what? We put uh, we fit a polynomial between what? P 1 3, P 1 3 x equal what? We fit a polynomial between x 2 to x 3. Now, using the Lagrange interpolation formula x minus x 3 divided by x 2 minus x 3 f 2 plus x minus x 2 divided by x 3 minus x 2 f 3. This is the Lagrange interpolating formula between x 2 to x 3. Now, again we put the values of uh, x 2 and x 3. So, what is the value of x 2? The value of x 2 is a 4, sorry. 
So, here we see the what is the value for x 2 and x 4 if we closely observe here what is the value value is a x 2 with the 4 and 8 21 and 73 21 and 73. So, here so here 4 and 8 21 and 73 4 here we write uh, x minus 8 upon 4 minus 8 into 21 plus x minus 4 upon 8 minus 4 into 73 into 73. So, after simplification of uh, this become what 21 minus 21 x minus 8 168 divided by what minus divided by 4 if we write uh, this one plus 73 x 73 x minus 4 3 is a 12 28 28 29 and this become 4. If we simplify this result, this become what? 73 minus 21, 3 minus 1, this become 2 and 7 minus 2, this become 7 minus 2, this become what? 3 21 x. So, what is the result? Result is a 13. So, 7 minus 2 this one become 52 x y 4 and 168 to minus 4 12 and 9 minus 8 minus 6 this become 24 and this become 124 divided by this one. So, this become 13 x minus 31. Once we verify the result, 31. Okay, sir. So this one is a result. So this one is a. It's a not a very tough process. Just we write. A, what is the? This one is a. This one is a given data, and we assume that p11 x is a polynomial of a degree one between one to two, two to four, p12, four to eight, p13. Then using the Lagrange interpolating formula between x 0 to x 1, we write a p 1 1 x. Once we write a p 1 1 x and putting the values, then we get a what? We get a 4 x minus 1 and 4 x minus 1 is a polynomial between between what? 1 to 2, 1 to 4 8. So, similarly p 1 2 x and similarly we find a what? We find a p 1 3 x. So, what is the result? Result is a, a result if we, what is the answer? If we write uh, these values here, there are three values and if we write a polynomial this p x, p x here we already we write this values. So, this one is a, this is a p 1 1 x equal to this one, p 1 2 x equal to this and p 1 3 x equal 13 x minus 31 and this is true for x lie between 1 to 2 and this is a polynomial if x lie between x lie between what x lie between 2 to 4 and this is the polynomial if x lie between 4 to 8 4 to 8. So, in some problem there is a need to find out a value of a function for a given values of a x. So, in this question what is the value there is a need to find out a what there is a need to find out the values of a there is a need to find out a, find out the value of a find out hence estimate the value of a f 3 and f 7. So, in order to find out a value of f 3 
we put uh, because x lie between 2 and 4 then p 1 2 x is a 7 x minus 1. So, here you may write this one is a f x. So, in order to find out the value for f 2 f 2 sorry f 3. So, f 3 lie between 2 to 4 f 3 lie between 2 to 4. So, here we put uh, x equal to 3 in a p 1 2 x. So, f 3 in order to find out the value of a f 3 we put the value for x in a f p 1 2 x this one is a 7 x minus 1. So, here we put 7 into 3 minus 1 21 minus 1 this is equal to 20. So, once again I repeat the statement we put the value of x if uh, once we identify which polynomial is satisfy this data. So, for x equal to 3 for x equal to 3 x equal to 3 lie here x equal to 3 lie here here. So, we use the second polynomial in order to find out the value of f 7 f 7 interpolate the value of a polynomial at x equal 7. So, now the question is a which polynomial we are going to use to put the value of a x equal 7. So, here if we observe first polynomial this polynomial is a valid for if x lie between 1 to 2 second polynomial is valid if x lie between 2 to 4 and third polynomial is valid if x lie between 4 to 8. So, 7 lie between 4 to 8. So, we use the we use the third one third one in order to find out the value of f of 7 f of 7. So, we use the third polynomial p 1 3 x this is equal to 13 x minus 31 this is equal to 13 into 7. 13 into 7 minus 31 this is equal to 7 3 is a 21 91 minus 31 this one equal to 0 60. So, this is the value of what once we verify this one. So, f 3 is a 20 and f 7 is a 60. So, what is the answer this is the polynomial of degree 1 between 1 to 2 p 1 to x is a 7 x minus 1 is a polynomial of degree 1 between 2 to 4 and 13 x minus 31 is a polynomial of a degree 1 between 4 to 8 and the value of f 3 means uh, if we interpolate the value of a function at x equal to 3 the value is a 20 and if we interpolate the value of a x at x uh, value of a f at x equal to 7 then this one is a 60. So, this one is a answer this one is a answer. So, this whole this one is answer this one is answer of uh, this question.